This is a little instructional for EMDR for your pets. Now, I got Tater here, um, rescued him from the pound. I have no idea what all he's been through. I've had him a while, but he's getting old. And he's usually cranky when, uh, or skittish when the fireworks go off. And people are complaining about their pets and fireworks. Ugh, let me get him to sit down here. He wants to be inside right now. Okay. EMDR is eye movement desensitization and reprocessing. There's three ways to do it. Um, the eye movement, which is very difficult. He's got an issue here. Uh, <laughs> okay, one is auditory and one is tactile. Right now he's, he's wanting to be inside. Fireworks have been going off. I haven't worked with him in a couple of years. But just tapping back and forth like this calms them. Okay, I've done it with other shelter dogs, he can go fast. Da, 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 da. He wants to go. <laughs> okay, if you go, good boy, Tater, good boy. You can also pet his ears back and forth like this. Okay, <laughs> he wants to go inside. The door open. He wants out. In. All right. So if you just pet him back and forth like this, or tap, he hears it and he feels it. And it's calmed him down when fireworks are going off. Right now he doesn't like me holding him. <clears throat> but you just say things like, good boy, good boy, Tater. And it calms them. I've had a, I worked with a friend's dog, several dogs. He wants inside, we're gonna let him go. But that shows you what happens if you just pet or tap their ears back and forth, it can calm them. He's a lot calmer with fireworks going off than he used to be or we live out in the country, so fireworks, gunshots, and other strange kabooms. Hope this helps.